to the arm. Oh, and a stop. What punishment being dealt from Amos. Yeah, impressive offense from Amos. Power slam incoming. No, from behind you, an inverted DDT. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. Back elbow smash. Nothing fancy. Oh, my, what a splash. Boom. Vicious right forearm. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. Come on. Leg trapped. Looking for the heel hook stretch. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. Foot right to the belly. Oh, the physicality on display there. Unbelievable. Oh, brutal forearm. Assaulting the knee with purpose. Everything working against Omas now. Omas has to exhibit some resiliency now. Great counter. He isn't allowing that burst of attacks to finish him. Okay. Big I press wide. He is looking to do some serious harm. Oh, what a strike to the back. are higher than ever as Omas challenges the dark horse for the WWE Universal Championship. And we've got to be ready for anything after their last match brought the house and the ring down. I've been assured precautions have been taken, so one of these superstars will be the only thing taken down. Ducking out of trouble. Oh. Ooh, pinpointing the trachea. Ooh, he went right into that 
turnbuckle. Leaving himself open here. Oh my God, all the way to the outside. That hurt. Looks like they want. Incoming. Oh my, apron sent high. Tremendous impact. What a move by the champion. And he gets sent back into the ring. Oh, he moves just in time. And what a maneuver we just saw there. And Omas pays for leaving an opening. Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. Kick to the gut. Oh, brutal for him. Bam! Omas looking evasive. Punch lands. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. What's he open to find down there? Oh, man, he grabbed the kendo stick. Everyone needs to watch out now. Compromised position here. Yeah, check their face out of that one. Yeah. Insult to your injury. Your company hurt. Getting tossed. Your Just a perfect hurt. mix of pure power and bad intentions. The challenger not looking good right now. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. Reversal! Can he take advantage? Oh, Nasty-looking inverted suplex. Counters, this could be an opportunity. Climbing the turnbuckle now. From the top. Whoa, what a landing! It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring, there is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. He'll head to the ring. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. And there was some force on that move. Boom! Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. No! Omar's with a vice-like grip on his opponent. What the game? Oh, no. Championship on the line! But the ref isn't even paying attention. Never mind what you're doing. Make the count. How on earth could he not keep him down for even one at this point? But Omar Opponent recover here if he wants to maintain his advantage. German suplex, but that's not all. In a record lariat, what a combination! No way, astounding power. And the knees! The champ will stay champ. Cover! Got it, and the champ adds to their legacy. Here is your winner, and still, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Cody Lady Destroyer. Nobody can keep the WWE Universal Champion down. The right man might not have shown up yet, but he will sooner or later, and this fluke run will finally end. What a title defense for him tonight. He came in with that unshakable champion mentality.
well, well, all hail the conquering hero. <sighs> Troy, what's got you so excited? Other than I finally got that promotion to producer, probably the fact that your stock is on the rise too. The response to your TLC match with KO was off the charts, and you've been on a roll ever since. I know my boss Miz has been taking notice. Okay, so what do you and Miz have for me tonight? Network sweeps are coming up, so we need to pop a big rating. And with your newfound popularity around the office, Miz has something very special planned for his undisputed WWE Universal Champion. That is the kind of cryptic answer that makes me uneasy. And when I'm uneasy, I get on edge. And when I'm on edge, that makes me want to go out there and create some chaos. Do you want me to create some chaos, Troy? Yes! That's exactly the kind of programming we want during sweeps. So head out to the ring, and we'll get to see how your chaos and Mrs. Big Surprise play out. Troy, I will head to the ring, and I don't care what Miz has up his sleeve. I'm going to tell your boss exactly what I think of him and his big plan for sweeps. Great! Sounds like rating. According to backstage sources, The Miz has something special planned for the WWE Universal Champion. That Miz is willing to let bygones be bygones after all this guy has done is honestly inspiring. What a leader. I haven't been on SmackDown very long. But if there's one thing I've learned, it's that when our GM has a must-see announcement, it's generally bad news for me. So, Miz, I'm not going to sit back and wait for you to try to pull one over on me. Whatever big surprise you have planned, I'm ready for it. Right now. Got to admire the champion trying to do things on his own terms. Come on, Miz. What do you got? If Miz was expecting to intimidate him, doesn't seem to be working. Hellfire and brimstone. It's Kane. Talk about a big surprise. It's the big red machine. But where is he? Kane is in the ring with a huge right hand. Kane's got him by the throat. Oh, no. Say good night, champ. Low blow from the champion. Where the heck is he going? When you're on the defensive against Kane, anything goes. And here's the superstar who's worked hard to get where they are today to reach the top of the division. Oh, yeah, and just look into their eyes. They do not plan on stepping down anytime soon. Focused and poised. If they play their cards right, guys, this match could be a declarative statement. And sizing him up across the ring is the big red monster, Kane. Mark my words, Kane is looking for his opponent's soul here tonight. I don't expect this brother of destruction to be anything less than a laborious opponent here tonight. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Oh, a shot. Shot. And here we go now. Elbow drop. Kane has really taken control here. Kane cannot be stopped right now. Smart strategy. Attack the knee. Great reversal. He's trying to bring the fight back in this one. Oh, a point of the chair with the kidneys. Kane prevents the attack from connecting. Oh, God. And these attacks are spelling nothing but trouble. And we might be seeing a competitor crumbling before our very eyes. And you never want to count a competitor out, but there seems to be no signs of defense right now. This is just getting uncomfortable at this point. And things are just going from bad to worse.
Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Fires back with a crucial elbow. Quick return to the ring. Outside the ring now, he has no need to rush. Run! He's got his right nose stick! Kane is losing. With the Irish whip. Kane reverses and oh my goodness, did you hear the ring steps? They heard that in Syracuse. Stop trying to suck up to Cole, Saxton. This has to stop. The WWE Universal Champion needs medical attention. No, not this. Not the choke slam on the steel steps. Straight to hell, champ. This is horrific. It serves him right. He said he was ready for whatever Miz had planned. That kind of hubris has consequences. Speaking of consequences, you have to wonder if the Miz understands the ramifications of what he's unleashed. I don't think he does. The Big Red Machine has his demented eyes set on becoming the next WWE Universal Champion. Buckle up. This is going to be one hell of a ride. Dominic Mister. Oh, hi. Uh, hey, Dom. What's up? I know things started out rough between us going for the WWE Universal title. It was dog eat dog, but I get it, because it was just like that in the yard back when I was in the joint. I, uh, sure thing, man. Water under the bridge. This thing Miz has going on with you and Kane, it ain't right but I think I might know a way you can take care of that big red freak. I am definitely open to some advice, especially since I hear Miz is going to announce a title match against Kane. Glad you're willing to listen, but not here. Miz has got stooges creeping everywhere. You want my help with Kane? Meet me out in the parking lot. I'll keep that in mind. Lita actually offered to help me out too. Seems like you gotta make a choice then. Get help from Kane's old flame, or fight fire with real fire. Me. Get help from Lita. I appreciate you, Dom, but Kane and Lita have history. I'm gonna see what she has in mind. Suit yourself. But just remember, when Kane beats you down and takes your title, you could have prevented it. Too bad. Okay, so what's up? Lita, I appreciate you helping me out against Kane, but why are we going to Mexico? What does this have to do with anything? 
Listen, I got my start in Mexico, and I ended up wrestling in some pretty out-of-the-way places. Dark, dangerous places. Okay. So long before I came to WWE and met Kane, I encountered a similar monster out in the jungles of Lacandon. They called him La Llama Roja, or the Red Flame. Are you messing with me? Not at all. I made some calls that I found him. So we're going to Mexico because if you can survive the flame, you might be able to defeat my dear ex-husband. That sounds like a pretty big if. Great risks, greater rewards. Come on, let's go on an adventure, kid. Okay. Let's go to Mexico. Oh, he reversed. No, don't just touch this. Nope. Okay, the game's cheating. I'm not allowed to pick up the ladder on the
need to do it. Just need to do it. The red flame was everything you said, Lita. My whole body is basically a bruise. La Yalmaroja is a legend, a monster. And as rough as you're feeling right now... <sighs> yeah? It's gonna be worse with Kane, especially now that it's a casket match. Can't wait. If you beat Kane at his own game, it'll go a long way to earn the respect of the WWE Universe. And now you know the kind of effort it's going to take to do it. It'll take everything I got. And then some. Which is why when grit and determination aren't enough to put Kane in a casket, maybe you use a little something extra. Such as? Check your bag when you get to SmackDown. When you use them, tell Kane his ex says hello. Team Extreme, train with Lita. The following contest is a casket match and is for the undisputed WWE An abomination straight out of a nightmare. Yeah, but that seven feet, 300 pounds of real life flesh and bone built for destruction. The big red machine ready to make the ring his ghoulish playground. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure Kane is planning to take sick pleasure in doing so. Galloping into history, defying all odds. There are no pinfalls, submissions, disqualifications, or countouts. The only way to win is for a superstar to force their opponent inside of the casket. After closing the casket lid shut, the remaining superstar will be declared the winner. Now, let the match be. Introducing the challenger from parts unknown, weighing in at 323 pounds, Kane! And his opponent from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 228 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion Cody Lady Destroyer.
Everything has led to this for the undisputed WWE Universal Champion.